For my sixth installment of Reflections, I'm going to go to a player who wasn't part of the Glenn Sather era, but was part of the Kevin Lowe era and helped contribute in a lot of ways, scoring so many clutch goals in key moments, had silky, silky sweet hands. I'm talking about Alish Hemsky. And if you don't believe me about him being clutch, just go on YouTube and look up his goals. Key goals, key moments. One I can recall was against the Detroit Red Wings in the 2006 playoffs. And another one that everyone should know about is the Derek Stefan mishap that led to a tying goal against the Dallas Stars with about 20 seconds left in the game. An amazing goal. One of those goals that if you were at that game, you're like, holy cow, I actually attended and witnessed that goal that kind of situation let's get on with his career as an Edmonton Oiler and his career in general Alish Hemsky was born on August 13th 1983 he is a Czech former professional ice hockey player he originally was a member of the Edmonton Oilers who selected him in the first round 13th overall in the 2001 NHL entry draft in the NHL, he played for the Oilers, the Ottawa Senators, the Dallas Stars, the Montreal Canadiens, where ultimately he would retire. And then he also represented the Czech Republic at two Winter Olympic Games. Hemsky entered his professional ice hockey career as a 16-year-old playing for H.C. Muller Paribais of the Czech Extraliga in his hometown of Paribais. He split the 1999-2000 season between Mueller and their junior club, 8C Mueller Parabais Jr. Hemsky decided if he had a better chance to be scouted, he would have to join a Canadian Junior League than try to make the jump in the Czech Extra League. He subsequently became the first selection of the Hall Olympics in 2000 of the CHL import draft. The following season, 2000-2001, Hemsky led all rookies in scoring with 36 goals, 100 points. He was named to the all-rookie team, was selected to play in the 2001 CHL top prospect game, and was awarded the Mike Bossy Trophy as the QMH, QMJHL's top prospect. Hemsky continued his success in Hull during the 2001-2002 season with 27 goals, 97 points in 53 games, and finished 19th overall in QMJHL scoring race. On October 12, 2002, Hemsky recorded his first career assist against the Nashville Predators. On January 4, 2003, Hemsky scored his first career goal against the Montreal Canadiens in his 26th game of his rookie season. During his rookie NHL season, he scored six goals and 30 points in 59 games and was a healthy scratch for 23. He also went pointless in all six of Edmonton Oilers' playoff games. Hemsky returned to the Czech Republic to play 47 games for H.C. Muller Paribais during the 2004-2005 NHL lockout. During that time, he scored 13 goals and 31 points Fifth on the club, Parabais won the 2004-2005 Czech Extra Liga for the first time in 16 years, and Hemsky was named Playoff Most Valuable Player in his efforts. During the 2005-2006 season, Hemsky had a career year setting a personal best in every major statistical category. He scored 19 goals. 58 assists and 77 points while playing in all but one game for the Oilers during the regular season. The Oilers captured the eighth and final playoff seed in the Western Conference. In the playoffs, they went on to eliminate the Detroit Red Wings in six games of the first round, beat the San Jose Sharks as well in the round two, and in the conference final, they knocked off the Anaheim Ducks in five games. The Oilers, however, would lose the Stanley Cup final in seven games to the Carolina Hurricanes. 
In the final year of his contract with the Oilers again out of playoff contention, on March 5, 2014, Hemsky was traded to the Ottawa Senators for a fifth-round pick in the 2014 NHL entry job and a third-round pick in the 2015 NHL entry job. He quickly found success on Ottawa's top line alongside center Jason Spezza, recording six points in his first three games. He finished the season with 17 points in 20 games as the Senators fell short of the playoffs. Unable to agree to a new contract with the Senators, Hemsky signed as a free agent a three-year $12 million contract with the Dallas Stars on the 1st of July. In signing with the Stars, he was joined by Senators linemate Jason Spezza, who co coincidentally was traded to the Stars in the early days to come. He also was joined by former Edmonton Oilers teammate Sean Korkoff in Dallas. Going into free agency, Alex Hemsky would sign a one-year, $1 million contract with the Montreal Canadiens. However, he would suffer a severe concussion during a game against the Anaheim Ducks on October 20th that ended his season only seven games into it. By September of 2018, the Canadians had not renewed his contract and no other team had yet shown any interest, although symptoms from the concussion were gone. On March 15th, 2020, Alex Hemsky officially hung up his skates and announced his retirement from professional hockey. Alex Hemsky was an, an am amazing, amazing player. And I hated the fact that he was on Dallas because I still had ill will to Dallas for all the stuff that they did to us way back in the day. But Alex, once an oiler, always an oiler, we'll always salute you. And we knew that we got the best years out of you as an Edmonton Oiler organization. God bless you, man.